No! Oh! I should have finished that guy! He mounted and I couldn't kill him! Damn it. Whoa. There was a guy behind that. I checked it even. Oh my god. Just jerk each other off! All in the same room, man. Keep doing it. YouTube, what's up? We're back in business, man. We're on the Modern Warfare 2 beta. There's only about a day left, and I've found probably the most fun class I've had in this game, and I want to show it to you guys today. I've literally created the Honey Badger. The Honey Badger is one of my all-time favorite assault rifles in COD. If you guys didn't play Call of Duty Ghosts, you guys really missed out on this gun, but don't worry, man. It's pretty much here. We don't waste any time on this channel, so I'm not going to waste all your time and put the class setup in the middle of the video, the end of the video, or just hide it from you. Like, what the hell? So instead, let's just get straight to it. I'm going to show you how I make this thing. There's actually kind of a little glitch that I use. And if you guys enjoy the video, make sure you leave it a like, comment, interact with it in any way. It helps the video get out there to people who haven't seen our channel yet, man. And MW2 is just getting started. But first of all, okay, the little glitch that I'm talking about. Come in here to your muzzle, and we're just going to put on the first suppressor that we have, the Bruin Spearhead Suppressor, okay? Then we'll come all the way back here to our stock. We're going to put on this Tempest P80 Strike. Stock. On the rear grip, we're going to do this Saken ZX grip just for some recoil control. I'm going to show you guys two things. Okay, here, if I get on the barrel and I put on the, let's say, 11.5 TH4 barrel, if I come over here to my under barrel, I can then put on this pineapple vertical grip, which gives me a lot of gun kick control and recoil control. Now, if I take those attachments off and I put on the 7.5 Tempest Firebrand barrel, I cannot put these on because the barrel locks it and the shark fin is the only one that I can put on. But if we do the H4 barrel first and then put on the pineapple grip and then switch it back to this firebrand barrel, I can actually keep the bonuses from the pineapple vertical grip on my gun without it actually being on there. It still counts as an attachment. Now I'm telling you guys, this thing is literally the honey badger, bro. It's insane. At close range, it moves like an SMG. At long range, it still deals the damage that the M4 is dealing. And you only have one more day of the beta, bro. You guys got to give this thing a shot. It's so much fun. But yeah, man, if you guys don't like the iron sights, I do personally, but if you guys don't, just take off that under barrel there, throw on the red dot. I also love the Delta four. If you guys want some longer range, that thing's super nice. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here she is, man. She looks just like the honey badger. As you can see, that under barrel has gone, but we're still gonna have the stats from that pineapple grip there. Hopefully this game though, I can kind of show you some close range, some long range kills, a little bit of everything. Uh, Cause the M4 is capable of it all, man. As long as you hit your shots, unlike what I was just doing. I accidentally switched my kill streaks to score streaks this game. Um, I was trying that out last night and then I accidentally left them. So I think I just got some points for capturing that flag. We'll see if I can finish it up here. I'm sure I'll die to someone sitting in a corner or some shit, man. Yeah, look at you. Look at you with your fucking decoy up there, bro. Look at you fucking mounted on the railing, dude. Call of Duty 2022, man. Call of Duty 2022, bro. I do not care how many times I die to this idiot. He's dead. He's dying. Period. End of story. Can't see him, can't track him, no username. Muzzle break is super bad, can't see him. I'm running back there, I literally don't care. Hey, enjoy my dead silence, bitch. I'd like to see you know where I'm at now. The only counterplay for idiots like this. I hope you guys have been enjoying the beta ban. I know I have. I'm honestly surprised at how much I've been playing this one map and doing the same shit over and over on like four different modes that I enjoy. It's kind of blowing my mind a little bit. I'm going to be completely honest. I've been wanting to post a lot more, but dude, to be honest, by the time my videos get into the YouTube algorithm, the betas have like, you know, like 10 hours left. It's super hard to get posting anything, but I've been having a ton of fun, dude. I hope you guys have gotten to level 30 to get all your beta rewards. I really wanted to get a video up on the fastest way to level up and do that. But yeah, man, it's just, uh, we just don't have enough time on the game, sadly, you know? All right, we are getting close to our streaks here. We should probably play a little slower. Oh, what up, bro? With a launcher. No, stop. I'm like a kill off. If I choke this, I will cry. I will cry real tears. There we go. All right, let's not choke the AC-130. Holy shit, what are you doing back there, bro? Is he capturing A and I didn't even see him? We 10-0? 11 and 0. You're not winning that gunfight, baby. Give me this juggernaut. Let's go. Let's go. Game's only halfway over. Come on, baby. No! Why does it take so long? Oh my gosh. You're kidding me. Dude, the score streaks aren't worth it. It was like 1750? 1750 or some shit, bro, for the juggernaut. Not worth it at all. I haven't used this thing yet, baby. Let's go. 
If I was playing on kill streaks, we have that 100%. Whoa. Can I zoom in? How does this work? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Y'all like that, huh? Y'all wanna hide in the back? Guess what? Not gonna help, bitch. Oh, it looks like the AC-130 doesn't auto-reload. That shit kinda sucks. Where's everybody? They all leave the game? It's dead quiet out here. <laughs> that was dope. Go get him, go get him. Bro, stop drop shotting. Punish the drop shot movement. It's gonna become so meta. I can't. I forgot we have a chopper gunner too, man. I'm pissed about that juggernaut. I think the chopper gunner is bugged right now. Like you can't really move around. Everyone's just hiding in here, bro. They get spawn protection too. It's a little hard to see everybody. I'm gonna be honest. You're not that guy, pal. You're not that guy, pal. Oh, from the back. No. Dude, after this game, I really got to go see what that diff that difference is. Oh my gosh, they can't leave A. They're so scared to leave their spawn. But yeah, I need to go see what that difference is in the Juggernaut. Because, dude, I'm telling you, the XP difference was like four four kills. Okay, for real, I got to know. I got Where are the kill streaks at? I got to know. Jeez, man. Okay, so instead of the 10 kills, it technically would take 12 and a half to get the Chopper Gunner. I switch them just back to back. Yeah, 10 and then 15. Bro, it goes all the way up to almost 19 kills. 1875. Five? That was definitely like a 15 kill streaks way more worth it to be honest. You know what would have been smart though, I guess? If you get kill streaks, huh? If you have score streaks on, you can just use your score streaks. The the points will count probably towards your next one if you're playing with a score streak. I should have thought about that and just it's like classic MW2 2009. I didn't even think about that at all. Maybe I trolled myself on the juggernaut there. I figured I'd had to give like one or two more kills, but I get the game plays just kind of here to like make a video and get something up. I know if you made it to the end, you're the goat. That's all I have to say. If you guys try out the class, it's super fun to use. It's really versatile. Honestly, it can be played in any way you guys want. Again, leave a like on the video, comment, interact with it in any way. It helps the video get out there to people who haven't seen our channel yet, man. We'll see you in the next one. Have a kick-ass day if you're just starting it. Sleep well if you're just ending it. Later, boys. Have a good one. Bye-bye.